The level of noise in your head greatly affects your ability to both work and relax effectively. If your brain had a volume dial, what notch would it be on right now? Two? Five? Nine? The most powerful tool for quieting the mind is the breath. In the following exercises, you'll learn to observe the breath, allowing it to become deeper and slower, creating a calming effect on your mind and body. One of the essential techniques is that the qualities of breath that you want to develop are to make it deeper, slower, quieter, and more regular. Let me repeat those. You want to make your breath deeper, slower, quieter, and more regular. So whenever you think about it, whether you're driving in your car, whether you're waiting in an office, whether you're sitting watching a movie, whether you're at home eating dinner, if you think about it, try to make your breath deeper, slower, quieter, and more regular. And again, over time, if you keep doing that, your breath will change in that direction. When your breathing is deeper, slower, quieter, and more regular, you are feeling better in both mind and body. Your nervous system is functioning more smoothly and all your organs are operating more harmoniously as a result. One of the most powerful techniques for transforming our lives is meditation. Meditation is found in all cultures and all religions throughout the world because it's so powerful and so effective. What's interesting is that most cultures meditate on a sound that sounds very similar. It tends to be something that starts with an O or an A and ends with an M or an N, like Om or Shalom, Salam, Amen, Amin. Even the word one has been found to work. And mothers and fathers intuitively know this when they hum to their babies. So meditation is very easy to learn, even though it takes a lifetime to master. But even a few steps in the right direction can make a powerful difference. To meditate, begin by closing your eyes and just focus on your breathing as it goes in and out. Now your mind will wander, but when it does, just bring it back, gently but firmly, back to observing your breathing without trying to control it. Then gently say a word. Let's just use the word OM because it's so fundamental. OM. OM. And repeat that over and over again. The focus is on the humming sound at the end. Now your mind will wander. When it does, just keep bringing it back to the sound over and over again. Om. When you do this, a number of good things begin to happen. First of all, your mind quiets down so you feel more peaceful. You begin to get better at focusing, so anytime you can focus better or concentrate better, you can perform better, whether in school, in athletics, or in the boardroom. When you can focus better, you do better. Anytime you can focus energy, and your brain is just a form of energy, you gain more power. A magnifying glass can focus the sun's rays and burn through a piece of paper. A laser is nothing more than focused or 
coherent light and you can burn through steel. So when you focus your mind, the effect of your mind on your body becomes enhanced and can be used to help heal. And when you begin to quiet down your mind and body, you begin to experience what it feels like to be more at peace and to be more joyful, not because you got something you thought you needed, but rather for the moment, you're letting go of the things that disturb your natural state, which again is to be peaceful and joyful and healthful. <laughs>